The Peltier Controller TEC28V15A is used for driving a TEC at high efficiency for regulating the object temperature precisely. It comes with the world's first built-in smart auto PID control microprocessor, which continuously senses and compensates for the thermal load automatically. There is also no need to use any external components to create a compensation network, nor is there any tuning involved. It has many features, high output voltage 28 volts, high output current 15 amps. Dimensions include 35.96 mm in length by 35.96 mm in width by 8.2 mm in height. It also provides these functions, low thermistor injection current, continuous bi-directional output, programmable output current and voltage limits, real-time temperature current and voltage signals, and selectable temperature sensor types, including thermistors, RTD, or temperature sensor IC. This video shows how to use high voltage, high current TEC controller TEC28V15AD and its evaluation board. Here we have the following items. Power supply, oscilloscope, load, multimeter, TEC controller and its evaluation board. Connect the wires to the evaluation board. Connect the power supply, oscilloscope, multimeter, and load to the corresponding pins of the evaluation board. Second, power on. The voltage of the power supply is 12 volts. The working mode of the evaluation board is DC temperature sampling. Turn on the S1 switch. Turn on the middle button of the S1 switch and make sure the SVDN voltage is 2.2 volts. Set the temperature. Adjust the potentiometer to set the TMS pin voltage to 0.5 volts, which stands for 17.5 Celsius degrees. At this time, the room temperature is 26.4 Celsius degrees and the product starts to cool down. Monitor the output temperature. Change the red light of the multimeter from TMS pin to TMO pin. At this time, the reading of the multimeter is 0.5 volts. Observe the waveform. Connect the two probes of the oscilloscope to TMO and IDR pins respectively. You can see the waveforms of these two pins on the oscilloscope. If the waveforms are all straight lines, it is good. If they are not straight lines, adjust the compensation network below. Measure the temperature difference. Change the black light of the multimeter from G and D to TMS, and the red light is at TMO pin. Observe the reading of the multimeter, which is close to 0 volts. It means that the TMO pin and the TMS pin have the same voltage which proves that the output temperature is the same as the set temperature. Adjust the multimeter gear. Adjust the multimeter from the V range to MV range, which makes the degree more accurate. Test the temperature. The temperature of the cold end of the equipment is 16.8 Celsius degrees. It means the low temperature is 16.8 Celsius degrees as well. The room temperature is 26.4 Celsius degrees. If you want to know more about our products, please visit our website www.analogtechnologies.com.